how to search and filter Amazon brand analytics keywords. Why is this important? How can it make you money? Well, if I am looking into getting into a new niche or I am just trying to understand what's going on in my niche with my, my own product or my competitor's product, this is a way that you can find top keywords that you might have been sleeping on or keywords even before you've started your listing helps you find those keywords that is getting sales for your competitors. All right, let's go ahead and jump into how you can do this. We're still in this ABA top search terms tool. Uh, I'm going to use it in a way where I'm going to search right here for one of my competitor coffin shelves, right? So I just went ahead and copied their ASIN and I put it here. And then I could use a lot of different filters uh, here, but I'm just going to go ahead and just look at what the raw data is. And it's showing me if I enter in any uh, ace in there, it's going to show me for the time frame that I chose, what were the, the keywords that they were one of the top three clicked. And then for example, I could see here, they were one of the top three clicked for coffin decor. So I might want to look at what, what was their conversion share? They were one of the top three clicked for coffin shelf. And I can zoom into my competitor's product and I can see that for this keyword, they got 23.8% out of all the sales, but me, my product, I only got 4.8%. So I, I might want to look into that and figure out what's going on. Uh, another keyword here, goth shelf. My product, let me see, my product is not even showing up here as one of the top three clicked. Maybe I'm not even ranked for this keyword goth shelf, but my competitor is getting sales from it. So I can do this one of two ways. I can enter in my ASIN or a competitor ASIN or multi-competitors ASIN, or I can enter in a keyword. Like for example, I, I can enter in coffin. Right. And then basically what's going to be spit out is all of the longer tail keywords that have coffin in it that has the minimum search volume that I specify in this tool. And then I could maybe get some ideas about what people are searching for that has the word coffin in it. So there's a lot of different ways to use this tool. Remember this data from brand analytics about top search. This isn't some helium 10 algorithm or some estimate that we're doing. This is coming directly from Amazon. And what the benefit of using it here in Helium 10, as opposed to in Seller Central, is now I can combine it with some Helium 10 unique data points that you don't have in Seller Central, such as the search volume and title density and you know the search volume trends and estimated sales and things like that to really help you understand what's going on with certain keywords and who's getting the most clicks, who's getting the most conversions and where there might be opportunity for you.